Before starting, ensure that you have set up your class sessions within the attendance activity prior to recording student attendance for a class. Navigate to and click on the attendance item within your course. The attendance tool will open on the sessions tab by default, displaying all the current sessions for which you may track attendance. Use the timing buttons in the top right of this tab to narrow the scope of the sessions you would like to view on the current page, and then use the choose date button that appears to jump to the range of time for which you would like to view your available sessions. Click on the Take Attendance button to the right of the targeted session under the Actions column. A tracking page will display your current student roster and their respective attendance status options. Please note, while still applicable for recording student attendance, the following steps assume you have not made custom changes to the status set tracking options. As most students are likely to be present for each class, begin by clicking the P for present option next to the set status for all users line item. This will automatically set each student's status to be recorded as present. Next, scroll as needed to the students who are not present and adjust their statuses as needed. When finished, click the Save Attendance button at the bottom of the page to save your tracking records for this session. The Sessions tab will reload, reflecting your recent changes. You may readjust any attendance record at any time by clicking directly on the session or by selecting the Change Attendance button to its right. The Report tab will display a comprehensive attendance report with filter buttons to conveniently display the specific records you would like to review. In addition, the Export tab may be used to create an exportable digital copy of your attendance report to store locally and print if you desire. You may adjust the settings on this tab to select specific students or date ranges to capture in the report choose a desired file format, and then click the OK button at the bottom of the page to download your custom report.